Our guide is the Quran, our religion is Islam. Five noble pillars upholding what is virtuous. To make the testimony is the base of the faith and the fast and the prayer, the pilgrimage in charity. Allah, 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 Allah. Welcome back to the, the, the Rahma video. Uh, it's been, I think, nearly three weeks since we did the last video. Um, so it's been very, very busy since then. We've had, um, Alhamdulillah, I went again to Albania. Um, this time taking my parents to Albania, Alhamdulillah, for the very first time. They were absolutely happy and chuffed to see all the good work which is going on. My daughters came, my niece, family came as well. So it was very, very a, a wonderful, wonderful uh, trip to Albania. And I always say this on many occasions, be it on TV, be it on radio, that um, parents' du'as are very, very important. Parents' du'as are very, very important. And I think um, to make sure that our parents can make du'a for us, I thought it'd be a good idea to take my parents to Albania. Because I personally think all the credit I give to my parents, obviously first and foremost to the Father and Father of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and then obviously my parents who make du'a for us after every namaz. So all we can say, Allahumma Rabbi Alhamdulillah, and we pray that Allah gives everybody's parents in a long and healthy life, inshallah. And those who have lost their parents, may Allah you know, give their parents, may they graves their God in a paradise. And Allah gives us feet to pray for our parents on a on, 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 on regular basis, inshallah. Um, regarding the academy in Albania, alhamdulillah, just, just received photos today from Albania. Mashallah, the, the basement is done, alhamdulillah. The ground floor is almost done. And where <coughs> the way things are going, it looks like, inshallah, by the end of December, we could have at least four to five floors up, inshallah. February, inshallah, my target is now winter is kicking in, end of November and December and January. These are the two months where it gets very, very cold. So, weather permitting, inshallah, end of February, we should have all nine floors up, inshallah. That's the outside, the shell itself. And then the interior work will start from, say, March, April. So, hopefully, inshallah. I did think maybe Ramadan might be a good idea, but now looking at it, there's a lot of work involved. Even if you do have the funds and the money, I still think maybe it could go beyond Ramadan. And we're looking at maybe October, November time, inshallah. Maybe somewhere around this time next year, inshallah. So brothers and sisters, do make lots of dua for the academy, inshallah. That we can have it up and running by end of 2012, inshallah. We've reached a half a million mark, alhamdulillah, in raising funds for the academy. We only got an, only another half a million left, so I'm hoping that inshallah you'll support us right the way through, inshallah and get this academy up and running. Good news is that um, the gold scale is in the office and sisters are coming in alhamdulillah, sisters are weighing the gold and alhamdulillah will tell you straight away how much your gold is worth and the masala regarding the zakat inshallah we shall let you know inshallah so please sisters, brothers as well, you can bring your wife's jewellery, your sister's jewellery, your daughter's jewellery bring it to the office, we'll, we'll wait for you and we'll show you how it's all done and it shall make it life very very easy for you Zamzam water, we have around 80 bottles left at the moment um, we're expecting 3,000 bottles coming in inshallah at the end of November looking at 20, between the 20th and 25th of November so 3,000 bottles, anybody want Zamzam give us a call inshallah ta'ala and you can place your order for, for the end of November inshallah ta'ala um, events, we've got an Eid event coming up, it's called Eid Mania it's on the 11th of November uh, it's next to the hall, next to Brajapati Hall. I can never say the hall, pronounce it pro properly. It's from 7 in the evening, it's a Friday night, 7 in the evening till late night. Um, <coughs> we've got Nasheed artists like Gamaluddin, Prince Abdi, and many other in Chastidah from Leicester, one in Chastidah from Leicester. And it'd be a, 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 it's a three course meal. If tickets are £15, you can come to Rahman Mercy and pick up your tickets, inshallah. We're also going to have a slight fundraise for Rahman Mercy for the Academy. Uh, we're not going to push folks, inshallah, but we are going to have a fundraising event as well. So, if you want a ticket, it's completely segregated, men on one side, ladies on one side, no mixing at all. That is guaranteed, on, um, because obviously, as Rahma is sponsoring this event, we want to make sure everything is completely in the right way. Uh, ladies on one side, and men on one side. It's a three course meal as well, so feel free to pick up the ticket. It's on a Friday night, 11th of November, inshallah, starting from 7pm till late night, inshallah. Other than that, uh, it's the month of Dhul Hijjah, alhamdulillah. Um, today is the second of Dhul Hijjah. Uh, these days are the most amazing days uh, other than Jihad. Uh, even better than Jihad is, going, is the, these 10 days of Dhul Hijjah are uh, Ibadat. 
you know, each fast equals to so much reward, each night of ibadat equals to the night doing ibadat of Laylatul Qadr. So it's huge reward. We need to spend these moments, these days, in the best way possible, in the best way possible, trying to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You know, uh, night's a huge night, to be honest. Uh, Isha, Isha is done by 8 o'clock, mashallah, and dawn's around 5.45. So we've got a huge, we can at least try to make an effort for the hajjud. In the worst case, Ali read two rakat before going to bed. As Allah Taala for He died, Allah Taala to guide us all. Inshallah, Allah make us better Muslims. And then the day of Arafat, which is going to be next Saturday, um, and it looks like Eid's going to be on the Sunday. Inshallah, Taala. So Saturday, that's one fast we should try to keep the day of Arafat. Inshallah, next week. Inshallah, Taala. The reward of it, the gunas of previous year and the, the coming year, the minor sins Allah Taala forgives all the sins. So that's how great Allah Taala is. One day of fasting. If this is one day where shaitan cries, where shaitan screams, where shaitan you know, moans, <coughs> it's a day of Arafat. It's, on this day Allah Ta'ala forgives each and every person, no matter how sinful we are. So brothers and sisters, take this opportunity, ask Allah Ta'ala for forgiveness, and you know, cry over our gunas. Because we, at the end of the day, I'm sinful, you're sinful, we're all sinful, we're all human beings, we do make mistakes. We try to be good, but along the way we do tend to fall now and then. So ask Allah Ta'ala to help us, Allah Ta'ala to guide us, and Allah Ta'ala to forgive our sins. And the last one is Qurbani. I know... Qurban is a very important act. Obviously, it's, it's first upon those people who are badik or mature, not on the small kids at all. However, if you want to give on behalf of little kids, feel free to do so. You can do so. If you want to give for Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam, if you want to do for the marhumin, and I would say look for the places which need it most. I know we have, we look for. It. I hope I'm wrong, but from what I understand, many other times we look for the cheapest place. It's cheaper here, 60 pounds for a whole cow, 70 pounds for a whole cow, 80 pounds for a whole cow. How about going for the place where they need it most? Where they need it most? You know, there are places in the world that are more expensive, much more expensive, however, they need it more. I mean, I'll give you an example of Rahma Mercy in Albania, Kosovo, where a whole cow is 560 pounds. One part is just 80 pounds. Now, for one part, 80 pounds in Albania, one part, 80 pounds in India, Pakistan is one whole animal. Such a huge difference. However, it's 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 something they need over there. It's not everybody every cup of tea where they can get uh, meat all the time. So if you want to do, if you've already done it, and if you've done it already, well, you can still do nafil kubani as well for Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam for the um for your marhumin. So please do, please do. You can make double. Come to Rahman Mercy. Give us a call. And not just Rahman Mercy. Any other place in the world, any other charity which is working and they meet, they need it. Even if it's a bit expensive, try to do. You know, a, 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 a food. Um, where the people most need it. This is very, very important. And those people that are doing Qurbani, many people think that if we're doing Qurbani, we can't cut our nails, we can't trim our hair, we can't uh, cut our nails. It's mustahab. It's mustahab. If you want to cut your nails, you can. If you want to cut, clip your hair or cut your hair, you can. There's nothing wrong with it at all. Um, it's, if you do it, it's rewarding. If you don't do it, there's no guna at all. There's no guna at all. So these are a few for that of Dil Hajjah. Um, and obviously Tabbir al Shriq as well is going to come as well and hopefully we'll probably do a video just before that inshallah but when Eid day comes inshallah remember us in your duas lots and lots of duas inshallah in Allah Ta'ala accepts our duas Allah Ta'ala makes us good Muslims and we die Allah Ta'ala gives us our khadim and khair lots of duas for the academy lots of duas for Rahman Masih Allah Ta'ala gives us the class Allah Ta'ala gives us the istiqamah to keep up the good work and once, 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 uh, once again I'd like to thank all our listeners and all of the people watching the YouTube video it's your contributions, it's your donations, it's your duas. We just keep it as well. Allah Ta'ala reward you the best in this world and the hereafter. The world is in your highest duas. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.